Hello, you wonderful people. I love you. <coughs> and I love my new deck that I got today. I love this one. I watch a lot. Uh, Goddess Queen, Just Me, 23. Yeah, y'all can watch her on YouTube. She's pretty cool. She does a lot of cool things. I want to see what kind of energy is coming out today. Spirit. Who really wants to talk to me and these people so much today? Would you please let us see who it is and we thank you. It's a Virgo. Virgo, here's your reading, Virgo. Let's give you a reading, Virgo, Virgo. Here's you a reading. <coughs> Three of Wands. You're being happy with the choices and outcomes in your life at the moment, you know. And you're not looking back. You're going to move forward. You you got good and great things coming your way, you know. You're seeing a bigger picture in this situation. And you've got a positive outlook in life at the moment. You're not, you're not worried, so good for you, Virgo. What else? What else is Virgo want us to know today? He wants us to know. Three of Pentacles, he wants to collaborate and work as a team, or she does, you know. They, they want to achieve goals, and you're building on your success. Woo! You're putting in the effort. That's how you need to be, okay? So three of wands, three of pentacles. You're seeing probably number sequences a lot, like 33s or 333 or 338. And eight of cups, you know, you're searching for truth and answers. And uh, you're receiving a, a wake-up a wake call at the moment. That's, that's what it is. And, you know, you're going to take the necessary time out and... Uh, Maybe you've already removed your heart. You ain't got no feelings for somebody anymore. And when you do that, you need to let them people be aware. Because they can feel it and see it and know it. Trust me on this, okay, Virgo? Okay, what else about Virgo? What's they want us to know? Queen of Pentacles. Oh, okay. Uh, he sees you as someone that's going to be of high social status. You're a social butterfly, and you're financially stable and independent, you know, and you're down to earth, and you're a natural healer. You know, you're a loyal, trustworthy person, and the welcomer or being, you're the welcomer of being kind-hearted to all. That's what you do, you know. You welcome it. And it could be saying this, uh, Virgo is thinking about uh, leaving uh, and going to work with someone else because his heart and feelings ain't in this anymore in this relationship and uh, is not is not in this relationship with his wife because pentacles means you know marriage oh and then Ada Swords right here you know he's he or she's feeling trapped or restricted and you know they're they're caught they're caught in a bind. They're in. They're in the middle. They're in the middle of something. That's what it is. And 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 you're all blocked. And you and you're not able to detach. You're just blocked. It's saying you're being confined and imprisoned to one area, and you're feeling helpless and hopeless at the same time. Oh. So. You're feeling tied to this marriage. That's good to know, Virgos. What else? See, spirit tells on you. Spirit, I can't take 12. What? What is underneath three of wands, spirit? What else? Is it? They don't want to be tied to this marriage. It's clear to see. It just said it. Oh, it come to light. Yeah, it come to light that, that there's a brand new beginning and... This brings positivity, you know. Sun is Leo energy, you know, and you got happy vibes and positive energy coming towards you at the moment, and you're just wanting to have fun, and success is headed your way, you know. Uh, you got a bright future with new opportunities and happiness and love and with yourself, see? You're not bound and tied to that old way of doing in your marriage. That's what it is, you know. Ooh, did you see that spirit? 505, it flipped out too right then. Death. 
Uh, there's an end in that bring and change, okay? There's a death of Virgo and an end. You're going to go through a transformation of ego in your old self. You're letting go of your ego. That's what you need to do in your old way of doing shit. That was, a, you know, uh, and you're letting go and separating from that old person and being, you know, and you're, there's going to be an unexpected event that's going to change your relationship. Did you hear that, Virgo? Okay. What else? Spirit said, loudy, loudy. He wanted me to take four. Okay, and they laid like this. Okay, so this one. This one. Oh, no, that was two down there. Okay, so king of wands and queen of wands come out, you know. You're seeing the bigger picture of life, you know. And you, you're a hustler, maybe, and you take charge and you take control. And you got confidence and you're a self-starter and people admire you for it. And Queen of Wands, you're confident and you, you're a lover and very passionate and you're being misambitious at the moment and independent, you know. You're highly respected and highly favored in your community and you got a strong down sex appeal and you do things spontaneously. Just out of the blink of an eye, you'll want to do stuff. Won't you, Aries, Leo, or Sag? You got that spontaneity, creativeness, you know, and you're you're outgoing and you're a cheerful leader. You know, you're deaf to that old marriage um, way of doing and you're a new marriage unleashed. You looky here, looky here. And the Empress, Queen of Wands, you turned into an empress, you know. You're a woman of power and a queen of all queens and everyone admires you. And you're very fertile and nurturing your divine feminine energy. And and here we got uh, four of wands, you know. You're you're a success. You're gonna you're gonna get married, you know, that's or you're already married, you know, you're gonna have a public celebration of your love though, and you're gonna come together and build a solid foundation and you and you got support from others in this endeavor and then it says nine of pentacles uh you, you know your old self is gone and now you're being seen as a you know plus a a, a a business woman and luxury and you you might live by yourself uh you're a bachelor bachelorette you know and you got high standards and and you got high maintenance and and here the emperor come right underneath, you know, king of wands, you know, because look, our it's it's the same people. Y'all went from kings to to ruling the kingdom, you know. This is masculine in power, stable and noble, high high authority, ruler of all, you know. You're disciplined and structured. You're the boss, and you're a wealthy man. And ooh, you're manifesting new ideas and projects at the moment, Virgo. And you're growing and progressing in this situation. And you got a long friendship that's that's turns to romance, and you're gonna have rewards and results from past seeds you planted, and uh, you're pausing and reflecting on all that has been done in that old relation. Yeah, you're reflecting on all your devil devil ways, you know, and that's your lower negative energy, and that's where strange shit will happen, you know, and. Maybe you was disregarding your lover's feelings, and it said you are, because it's saying right here, and you had obsessive ways, and you had a lustful energy tied to you, you know, and and you had violence with assault and abuse in your relationship, and, and you focused on money, and you fell for temptations, you know, so... You're you're working on stopping doing that, Emperor and Empress, King of Wands, Queen of Wands, you know, it come to light. <laughs> So now reading it this way, it says, you are, you're standing there and you're being happy with how the choices you made, okay? You're not looking back or moving forward. This is coming to light. You got a brand new beginning and it's in a marriage, okay? And they could be, uh, and you you're all might be going to work together in a business also and uh, this, uh, old you, you transform from this old you and you let go of ego to become this person of honor and status in the community. <laughs> and you're, you're not, 
you're not looking back. You've turned your back, you know, and you and, and you received a wake up call from the divine, and and you and you have to, you know, you had to t have to take a necessary time out, cause uh, your damn heart and feelings is no longer involved, and you and you know, you you got to remove yourself from a horrible situation. Uh, and you gotta see the bigger picture, you know, and you gotta hustle every day if you want a good life, and you know, and a lot of people admire you, Emperor, because you're a masculine that's in power, you're stable and noble, and, and you're a boss, and you're a wealthy man, and you know, you got high social status, you're a social butterfly, and you're financially stable and independent, and you're down to earth, and people love you for that, and uh, you, you know, you're confident and, ooh, you're a good lover and you're very passionate. And uh, you're very ambitious and strong. And that's why you're you're manifesting your new projects and you're working and you're seeing it grow. And, and uh, you're not feeling trapped or restricted or caught in a bind or in the middle anymore. You turn into a woman of power, a queen of all queens. Everyone admires you. You're very fertile and you're nurturing people and things around you at the moment divine feminine energy and because we got rid of all this lower negative energy you know and and we don't want those strange experiences and, and drug life you know and uh we're letting go of it we don't want this we're letting go of the dark side the dark ways of doing we're breaking all them bad habits we're breaking them all okay so that's all it means. So that's what it is. So now I'm gonna do my messages and then that's all I'm gonna do. I'm not gonna read a big, big bunch. But what does a Three of Wands want to say? What does Virgo wanna say? Three of Wands up here. That you might have to make a decision in a quicker split second, okay, Virgo? You or somebody around you might have to do that. And what about Three of Pentacles, building a business together, just cooperating. Uh, they could be dark energy is being sent to us from some dark spiritualist, maybe in the tarot community, okay? Three of Pentacles, so some dark energy is coming from them. And Eight of Cups, uh, you're turning, walking your way uh, away from somebody that might have been spying and link, and link to your emails and... The law is well aware of who's doing this shit to you. You know, Gmail, Yahoo, Outlook, all your email addresses. They know who does it to you. And Queen of Pentacles, thank you, law. Queen of Pentacles, you're a divine feminine. See, you know, this is you. You don't trust you. You're very intuitive and you work from heart center. You're very compassionate, wise, accepting, forgiving, collaborative, reflective heart. You reflect on how you show up. And Ada Sword said... What about feeling trapped? Oh, you was feeling trapped. And every time, it says, every time I see you, my heart about races plumb out of my chest. And it's it's a very intense feeling when I see you walk by. Your heart's a racing. Bum, 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 So, Divine Feminine, you need to go towards that. You know what I mean? And what about this? It come to light. What about it come to spew it? You drop it plumb over here. Hang on. Spew it, Sid. It come to light, business owner. It come to light that you, we all have a guide deep inside all of us. And our guides is trying to show us that we need to trust the guidance deep within ourselves. And listen to those little whispers of self. Listen, business owner. It's telling you to listen to them little whispers, okay, business owner? Listen. I like that little angel and how it come out. Oh, and what about the death? What about the death? Death and rebirth. Death and rebirth. Yeah, you let go of negative and now you got positive. That's what you killed. <laughs> You killed all that negative, and King of Wands said, when the universe has sent you a person into your life, you need to trust and have faith that it will all manifest for you both at the right time. Oh, and they might be wanting to 
sweep in the bed with you. I don't know. <laughs> but this Queen of Wands, she says, out with the truth. Out with the truth. Now, you know you was trying to set us up, you little witch. Out with the truth. That's what we're saying to that's what Queen of Wands is saying to y'all, okay, Virgo? This Aries Leo or Sagittarius woman around. Oh, and Empress, you need to go on a vacation, honey. You're getting ready to go on vacation. And Four of Wands, Four of Wands. You might be getting ready to go on vacation with, with your marriage, okay? And what about Four of Wands? What about Four of Wands, Spirit? Somebody in that you're married to, whoever's watching me, has put tracking devices on your vehicles and your phones. And you notice when you go to town that the law follows you. Someone in your marriage did that. Listen to me. That's what it's saying. And Nine of Pentacles right here says uh, she, she wants to live a good life. And she stopped relying on her luck. She started putting in the work and... And like everyone else on this planet has to do to heal their issues from the past, you have to put in the work. We know that. And Emperor, Emperor, you could have ghosted your Emperors, you know, because you needed to clear up a lot of karma in the, from your past that you gathered over the years. Now do you see? Now you see me. Now you don't. Maybe Emperor thinks you ghosted him, but... Seven of Pentacles says some of us have nothing to worry about because we did not have anything to do with none of this shit. So we're not worried, honey. Okay? And Devil said, Devil said, Devil, here's what we say, Devil. Devil, Devil said, hey, there's a rival woman around us, okay? And Devil, we want you to be fully aware that we have that we're protected by the divine, and we have this, and it outpowers you and this rival woman, okay? And we might have to make a quick second, split second decision, and the angels is going to let us be aware of it, and they're going to let us be aware of that. It's because we're in a high vibe twin flame journey, okay? And shouting out to you from divine and universe, and they love you. And somebody has the way, a problem with the way we do things, but they ain't never they ain't never had the courage to actually go do what they want to, people in your community or tarot community. Okay, what about this person could be spying in their dick faces and they love spying on everything because they know this is our destiny. They know that this is our destiny and they can't keep messing with it. And what about Divine Feminine, Work from the Heart Center? Divine Feminine, because you're reflective and started talking and you're wise, you're letting people know that somebody's so-called friend out here put a contract on Divine Feminine and Divine Masculine's heads, and uh, they might have been trying to get y'all shot, okay? And maybe whenever, like me, I had a experience where my heart, I didn't know if I was having a heart attack or what, but... I'd left back to Virginia, and I was feeling real sh sh uh, My mask going on member that time that I'm talking about, but I went to Virginia, and I was gone for a day or two, and and it was crazy, And but it, it seems like these two people was involved in setting this shit up, and it keeps laying that meth, meth people I know did that to me, Divine Feminine. And every time I see you, my heart beats a million miles an hour, and I love you. Because we laugh. <laughs> Somebody you laugh with a lot loves you big. And you feel it. You're like... Bum -bum 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 -bum. Oh, and listen. We all have to listen to the whispers of self. Because you're getting a special delivery. Special delivery. Angels are helping you. What about positive... No negative energy? Positive. No negative. Because we appreciate everything that in life that God bestowed upon us. And you see a person, when somebody sends somebody into your life, know that it could be the person meant for you. And God did it because it's high five, high five partnership. And, and you got to remember not to take people for granted uh, that's been there, you know, for you. Uh, you don't take people for granted. And out with the truth, somebody was trying to set us up because 
So this person might have been a needy partner of yours, and they want you with them forever and ever. And go on vacation. What about go on vacation? Go on a vacation, and it could have been a brother could be involved in a situation, and you didn't even know this, your brother. So don't go on vacation with your brother, okay? And what about somebody put a tracking device on you? vehicles and they might have did this whenever you was scatterbrained that's why you was scatterbrained didn't know what to do and it was people fucking with your mind and can't rely on your luck you gotta put in the work oh someone wants to give you a kiss they're falling head over heels in love with you and they're going wing, 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 wing. they love you out there queen of pit I mean, nine of pinnacle business woman, and it might be this emperor that you might have ghosted or he ghosted you, but y'all had to clear up karma. Does he get it? Why? And emperor, somebody might be trying to come around and screw you, so pay attention. <coughs> and But their wicked ways is catching up to them, and they didn't know that you would figure out who was doing it, okay? But you did. You figure out who was playing with you. And some of us have nothing to worry about because we didn't do none of this stupid shit and rival woman. Because uh, we had to cut off people that we used to party with so we could come together with our twin. Only puff, puff, pass with our twin. That's all we want to do is with him, yeah. And this rival woman, this devil, this devil ancestor moved beyond old ancestral patterns and quit doing the same shit that your family did. Maybe you had a house, a family of sluts, you know, and, I, and it's connected to you. But you had to learn the difference between lust and love. And now we know that. We know. We know, and that damn rival woman fucking knows that we know, too. <laughs> yeah, they do. Don't you worry. They do. And I'm going to get maybe three or four more messages. And can we have a higher by twin flame journey? The angels watches us. Because we're people who has a peaceful demeanor, and we're happy with herself. And we're blessed, and we're healed, and somebody's got a problem. Somebody's got a problem because, you know, y'all could be mirroring each other at the moment and scared to come together. But, you know, uh, remember, this is the law of attraction working for you all. This is your destiny. This is your destiny, star destinies, okay? And Methy's, Methy's said they want to drown us. They want to take us to go swimming. So they can drown us. No, that's okay. And ooh, the inner divine masculine heart goes a hundred mile an hour every time we laugh because we're ascending. And, and he knows we had to clear up all those psychological issues to rise up. Special delivery, love. Listen to me. Special delivery. Now listen. Because you have a guide deep inside of us. Listen to them whispers. And take conscious steps to work towards your goals every day. And navigating how you need to show up the right way. And this person that was wanting to cling to you till death. They may have a disease. And he's scared to tell his partner, it says. And they might want to drown you, whoever that is. Now, I don't know who these messages are for, so now remember what I'm telling you. And this brother that might want to go for you to go on vacation with him, but no, because you know that he's a bunch of he-man woman haters. And uh, they they hate women. And when you're scared by it, it's hard to figure out what to do and why. Uh, and remember, they somebody that might be putting poison or some clear eyes in your coffee to make you shit your guts out or trying to kill you for good. And that might have been why you was feeling scatterbrained. And it was the same people who had a tracker on you. See how spirit tells. Spirit, I love you. And somebody wants to kiss you and they see you growing and you're putting in the work and not relying on luck and they love you big. 
Oh, and they said, we know that there is no coincidences in life and everything happens for a reason. And we also can't stop thinking of you. And they love only you. They got to have you. Oh, wow. And it's telling you, keep an open mind with your twin. And people that's manipulated you in the past, remember that this person was offering you up on a platter to your ops, the ones you had to cut off in whatever situation in your life. And, uh, and your ancestors telling you to move away from old ancestral patterns. We're helping you because we're Native Americans. Hey, y'all, hey, y'all. You like that card? Hey, y'all. I do. I love it. It's our destiny. And they might be somebody around on psychotic meds like Xanax. And they sit around high all day. And they need to be aware how their drug use affects people in their family. Okay? And I am aware. And I don't do that. And no, no, I don't. And Spirit, can we have one or two? Oh, and they're having meetings on us in the community at the moment. And it could be an ant involved with this. Auntie B, Auntie B, it says. So somebody in the community is talking with your aunt. It's some aunt or aunt figure in your life that, you, that might live around you. And she was the one that started all this shit in the legality system. And she's well aware, and you're well aware, and the law's well aware that we're well aware. Okay, oh, we're well aware. We're well aware, law. But they know that you're going through a total metamorphosis, and they see what you're doing. That you're made for dreams because... We're healing our insides to show up better on the outside community, yeah. And they somebody that might have got a, a contract in your name and you didn't even know it. Or you could be somebody that's going through a marriage and you're getting ready to get a divorce because the contract needs to be broken. It's telling you right now, okay? It's telling you right now it needs to be fucking broken. And Some woman could use her looks to charm her man. Oh, and that's the one I was looking for. False police report. That's what that aunt did. And all because you are a mystery to these group of individuals. And they didn't know how to, uh, they didn't know anything on you. So they started going to anybody they could and got little bits and pieces of information. And then they started saying yes, this and that. And. And you escaped all the traps that they set for you. So you go need you need to go on a tent excursion with you and your partner and go be in love and love in that tent all night long. All night long, baby. All night long. Show your Indian side all night long. That woman that did that was on the outside looking in on no looking in on a life she didn't know jack shit nothing about. Oh, uh, no, 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 ain't it so? Uh, oh, oh, now, woman, you're gonna have to go to a preliminary hearing case over of obsession on another woman. Oh, whoa, 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 that's what it is. And she might be somebody doing voodoo on you, but it don't matter because we're we're a, a spiritual shaman. We we know how to cleanse that energy. That's what it means. And y'all. We get that from the Native American Indian blood, and we love you, and we thank you for it. And somebody that we know it passed away might be floating around to this day, and they don't like what you was doing to this person's life, and they're going to come haunt you, as you better watch. And my lights is going off. Ooh, the lights went out. Ooh, they come on, 2858. Ooh, better be listening to me. And look here. It was the banana gang gang. They just wanted to come and give you some pecker and cock and dick and oh and they and, and and we're telling this to banana gang gang. Don't go to don't go to a gunfight with a knife because you'll lose every time. Okay, don't have a knife, banana gang gang. We're going to use our knife to cut your banana off. <laughs> twenty nine, twenty nine, eleven, eleven. I love you, my twin flame. I love you. Have you noticed yet how much I love you? And I love you so much. I'll be back here tomorrow to tell you another message. And it's getting good. And you're finding out so much stuff. And I'm glad. And I can't wait to give you a giant kiss tonight. Mwah. I'll see you later. Peace.